Hey guys, it's Asher Does Stuff, and today I'm going to be doing a walkthrough. And the walkthrough is for Pop Tropica's Arabian Nights Island Part 1 out of 3. Um, so I am very excited for today, and if it helps you, tell me what island I should do next, if I should do Arabian Nights 2, because I also know how to do that. But I probably won't have enough time in this video. So, let's get into it so i have completed two times um on this account um i restarted it so we can do it so when you press play it is going to say the 40 thieves are ransacking the town find their hideout and put a stop to it press start and so okay i am just going to I'm gonna put, um, my doggo, wait, 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 what, no, wait, wait, what, okay, I'm going to put both pets away, I don't know why they are equipped, alright, now, just us, so, when you join, you are going to go this way, you're gonna go to your right, and, so, um, if you wanna talk with people, you can, um, you can watch that video for two prizes, um, if you want. You might not, but that's okay. So, um, you're gonna keep going past that guy through the, through the lagoon thing. Oasis, I think. Yeah, that sounds right. Um, you're gonna pass an ad if you have it, which you probably will, unless you disabled them. So... Oh my god, my eyes freaked me out right there. So, this place is a little bit freaky. And I don't know why, but it just is. And you really try not to fall through that sand. Um, so you're going to jump towards the bones. You're going to keep going. And you're going to fall through this quicksand. And so you're going to see a box, a pickaxe, and a shovel. <laughs> And cloth, which when I was little, I always thought it, it was a giant tongue. I have no idea why, don't ask me, because I don't know. So once you enter the cave, if you can push these boxes, and you're going to push this one all the way to the edge. You're going to jump, you're going to use it to get up. Then you're just going to fall um, and push this one down there. Whoever was living here is long gone. So you're gonna push it and the rock will block it. And so don't jump all the way up or else you kind of have to start over. So that is quicksand right there. And you're gonna want to push this one down there. And careful, cause there are scorpions. So you're gonna push it. You're gonna push it. Maybe I need more. There we go. I don't know why I was going so slow. So you're going to um, use that to get up this ladder. And all the way up. So you're going to push this crate as well. You're kind of going in a, giant cir in a giant loop thing. So you're going to go up and don't fall through the quicksand. Um, don't, guys. So make a big jump and another big jump and then you will find this and it is salt and this can't be the 40 thieves hideout there's nothing else here so um exactly so now you're just gonna kind of um get out um so you guys are just going to um fall through the quicksand because that's going to bring you right back and make sure that you got the salt Definitely make sure that you have the salt. And you're gonna leave the cave. Don't worry, it is possible to get out because you are able to jump through quicksand somehow. Pop-tropical logic, I don't know. So this, um, you could, you really have to jump over it and it's very annoying. And so um, down here, there's really no use for it. So you don't even have to bother. So, we're going to keep going past the ad. 
past the ad and through the oasis and now you you could talk to this guy if you would if you would like where do you think the 40 thieves have their hideout um so um you could have talked to him before we went in there because it all makes sense now so yep all right so now you're going to go this way to your left and what you're going to do once you get into the town to the grand bazaar is you're gonna go to these steps that are about that are about five feet tall for some reason you're gonna jump up and you're gonna go to this lady and tap on her she'll say let's trade and you're gonna trade your salt for cloth say deal because you're you have infinite salt right now well you have infinite salt for like the whole thing so i just traded my salt but i <laughs> still have salt so that is good and now um you are going to you're gonna go to the sky sorry guys i just had to think um because I didn't remember for a second. So you're gonna trade the cloth. If you trade that, you're gonna get grain. And I don't know why you'd want that because you don't really need it. So you're gonna trade your cloth for that. And you can always get cloth again. You could go get it right now, which is what I'm going to. Well, I'm not gonna get it right now. So you're gonna take that spyglass and you're gonna jump up this pillar. And so, oh. Uh, my head was off for a second. All right, so now if you look through it, you're able to see everything, right? So you could see that guy. So what are you supposed to do? Well, you're going to trade your cloth for, well, you're going to get some cloth because this lady has like a hundred things of cloth. So, you can get the cloth, and now you're going to go where that guy was standing. And so, basically, we are going to catch the thieves now. And, um, what are they hiding? I don't know. So, you are going to place down cloth. So, use. Now you have cloth right there. And so you can ask this guy right here, like, so like, what's going on here? This this used to be the bazaar, but we moved to the other side of town after the 30, 40 thieves kept raiding us. Oh, uh, pick the second one, I think. So, so if you set something down here, they're, they'll steal it before you can even turn around. And no, it does not mean you walk away and go back and it's gone. You actually have to go all the way back to town. So. And now. You can go up to the um, spyglass thing. Alright, so now. You can see your cloth. And the spyglass. Where are the thieves? So you're. Where could the thieves be? Hmm. <gasps> Alright, so. And the thieves, they're. They are taking our cloth. And they left something behind. Whoa. What's that? I should. I shall. I shall not say the word for YouTube. All right, um, you guys are probably gonna know what it is. It's going to say it. Cannot say it for YouTube, or else I'm gonna get a. You know, I'm not able to say certain words for YouTube. So they left behind a smoke. You know, okay, they left behind a smoke bomb. I am just going to say it because. Um, I'm not really going to lose any money, because I am going 
because I am not monetized. I make videos for you guys and for you guys only. So up here is a little Sandman. I don't know why I came up here. So you could just um. Oh, and also, guys, um, you are going to equip it. So whenever you press action, you can you can do this to her, and they will be coughing. And so, what's the purpose of it? Well, the purpose is you are going to go all the way over here to somewhere that we have not been yet. You're going to go to your left. And go all the way. And um, you guys will see what is over here that you need. So, um, you guys can see that if you try and go in the palace, halt. And you can't do anything. So, what to do? Well, um, you're gonna climb on the things like this. And so, here you can listen to their conversation. So, do you really think there are 40? 40 what? 40 thieves! That helmet of yours is too thick. Oh yeah, I knew that. I found something the other day that belongs to them. Really? Let's have... Once they get close together, throw the bomb. Now they're both coughing, and you can enter. Without a problemo. Alright, so in the castle, you're going to go over here. And so, um, you could make... You can make everything make sense if you would want. You can, um... You can be responsible. So you're going to talk with him. Um, what happened here? The 40 thieves happened. They ransacked my palace and left me with nothing. You mean you're broke? Money can be replaced, but the thieves took one precious thing from me. A land that is like no other if I did, and I will get you. That is for what I ran out of air. <sighs> How can I find the lamp? I don't know, but perhaps you could start your quest with this. It's my last jewel. Trade it wisely. And yes, guys. Um, so if you trade it to the wrong person, trade the thing that you got and return back to them, and then you go get your thing back. So, how did you come out of there? If the boss finds out about this, we'll be in big trouble. I can't lose this job. This is all I have left. Can you do a favor and keep this between us? What happens if the desert stays in the desert? Totally not. <laughs> you get, you don't have to do that if you want. I just did it. I just did it. I don't know why. So you are going to head to your right and trade the jewel wisely. Like he said to. <laughs> now what you are going to do first is you are going to trade with Camel Man. So click on him, let's trade. You're going to put your jewel and you should see a pearl. What happens? And so he won't trade anything for salt. So that's where you're gonna use the jewel. The jewel. So that's a deal. And if you think that I'm wrong, which I'm not, um, you could always trade the pearl back for the same jewel. Now, if you go up with that pearl, you are able to go to, the, go to her. Let's trade. Trade the pearl for a camel statue. An ivory camel. Now you're going to go back down to this guy. And what, what are you going to do? Well, you're going to trade that to him. And I can't believe what I'm seeing. And it doesn't bite my camel for this. So, what is that? That is the leash camel bridle. If you can control him, this camel will follow you just about anywhere. So, what does that mean? No, wait, what? Wait, what did I? Now, press use. And now, oh, by the way, guys, um. You could get rid of the bomb, I think, by now. Yeah. 
you can ro you can get rid of the bomb out of your hand. So you want to go very slowly with the camel because you're not able to go fast as you can see because it's going to get mad at you. So you want to go slowly with it. And so you can't go in high places really. All right, all the way over. All right, and so now you're going to have the camel be stolen, sadly. So put him on the altar. Well, ceiling platform, I don't know. I watched the video to win two prizes. Now um, you're going to go back and basically do what we did with the cloth. So you can't get up there, so you have to use the five foot stairs. And you can get up. Now, you are able to watch the camel. And so, if you go up, there is nothing there but the sad sandman. So, where could the thieves be? Oh, there it is! So, he'll chuck the smoke bomb. That guy's not coughing. So... Oh, good. He's not taking it away. Good. Wait. He cheated! Now, he's going to take him to his lair. Open sesame! Guys, that is how you open doors in the future. <laughs> and then they disappear. And that was Arabian Nights episode numero uno. And you can exit out of the spyglass. So we're not done yet. So that's where their hideout is. Don't, we're not done yet. We have a little bit more. To go all the way. Over. And over. And so the camel is gone. Now, if you go into the oasis... Open sesame! You can go in and disappear and for some reason not drown. Got the eye medallion. So guys, I hope you liked the video and I hope it helped. I, and I hope you liked the video. If you did, hit the like button, subscribe, and click the bell so you don't miss another video. And yeah, bye guys!